Babe, are you sure you want to do this? There are other ways to handle this situation. Like what? Uh, you could leave him. There is nothing wrong with divorcing a cheating husband. You could take Sarah too. I have told you, my family unit is very important for Sarah. And you? What about you? Ayo and I will find a way. We'll figure something out. Look, babe, I feel so awful for setting this up for you. You know, I could call Dave and let him know that you changed your mind. You don't have to do this. My mind is made up. All I need to do right now is just take a shower and be ready. Shower? What were you doing in the other time? Shading. Babe, come on, you need to calm down. Okay, look, I don't want you to wake up tomorrow and hate yourself. I love you too. Now, if you will excuse me, I need to get ready. Um, hold on. Hey, beautiful. Hi. I'll be right back. Are you okay? Yes. Can I come in? I see you've never done this before, do you? So... Why do you want to do it? He cheated on me. Damn. I, I saw a video of him sleeping with another woman. Are you serious? I, I know it sounds crazy, but I want to work this out with him. We have a daughter together. So, this is about getting even? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Good. So, so, so what, what do I call you? Um, David or Dave? Come on. I'm just your man tonight. Your body's perfect.
Hello? Got from already. Have you checked out yet? Yes, why? I think I need a whole night of getting the car. To actually... To actually move on. Okay, I will rebook the room. Thank you. I, uh, some of us are heading to Lesica for drinks. Bill is on the bed, the boyfriend. Are you in? Oh, no, I can't. Uh, we have other plans. We? My wife and I. See, do, do you know, like, I, I keep thinking when I get married, I, will I be into my wife just like you? We all pray for that. Fine. Happily married man. Good night. Good night. Drink responsibly. Dad. Yeah? Caleb took my pencil. Caleb? Again? Yes. Don't worry, I'll buy you another one. Okay. Is mom coming home today? Uh I would have to find out no mom. I want mommy. Honey, I want mom to, but mom has to go on a little vacation. What's a vacation? Uh, a vacation is a place adults go when they're tired and they need to rest, okay? Okay. All right. Yay, we're home. Are you happy to be home? Mm-hmm. So, um, Get inside, show me your assignments, and then we'll do it together. Okay. All right, let's go. Upstairs, take a shower. Mm. Oh. You really did miss me, didn't you? Daddy missed you too. Oh. You have grown taller than the last time I saw you. I remark it. <laughs> Daddy's not gonna like that, but if you go to my room, take off your shoes, I'll definitely convince Daddy too. Okay? Off you go. Hey, Sue. Hello, Ayomide. So it's Ayomide now, not Ayo. Wow. Hey, darling. Mommy's coming. Sue, Sue, please wait. Sue, please. Don't I'm touch sorry. me. You're sorry. What exactly are you sorry for? That you cheated or sorry that I caught you? I'm sorry that I hurt you. I'm sorry. You did more than hurt me. I know what I did was dumb. I was foolish. I regret it. Dumb is forgetting to take the trash out. Dumb is when you forget to take your wallet. Dumb is when you forget to pay the nepo bill. What you did, what you did, cheating on me, 
recording it on your phone and leaving it there for me to see, that was plain malicious and evil. And guess what? It's going to take me a damn long time to forgive you. So, so, so I understand. And I hear you. Whatever you do to me right now, I'll say, is absolutely justified. And I'm willing to do anything to make this work. Really? I, I would go for counseling. Yeah, great. I have a few questions. Why? Who is she? She's nobody. She was fucking my husband. So she is somebody. Tell me, who is she? Her name, her name is Ol Oloma. Great. How did your dick fall inside her? Sue. Don't sue me. Answer the damn question. She, she's an old friend. From high school, we reconnected on Facebook. A few months ago. So, why, why do you want to know? Because I need to know who this girl is that has made you break your damn vows to me and your promises. So I ask you, Ayomide Emmanuel Salami, how did your dick fall into her? We, we chatted a few times. And she hit me up, telling me she was coming to town. Suggested that we had dinner. Do you remember the night I told you I was going to Fort Gat for training? Oh, fuck. 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 It was, it was that night we, fuck. we had dinner. We had too much to drink and one thing led to the other and... That was... that was a night I could not reach you on the phone. And you told me that you were hanging with the boys? Yes, I did. Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> How many times? So... It was a one-time thing. Are you in love with her? So... Everything in me, and with every fiber in my being, you are the only woman that I love. I swear. Well, I'm finding that so difficult to believe right now. So, Ayamida, I need you to... to leave this room and go straight to the guest room. Sue. Do you want to tell me about Sarah? She's going to ask questions. Would you, would you rather I left this house? Because that is the only other option. I admit it, I cannot bear to look at you. I cannot bear the sight of you. I definitely cannot stay in this room with you. So I admit it, I need you to get out of this room this minute. So please. Get out! I'll be in the other room if you need me. I do hope you need me. Get out. Yes? Please don't tell me you've changed your mind. No, of course not. I'll be there by 2 p.m. What time is it now? Oh, shit. Babe, please just give me 15 minutes, okay? I'll meet you up. Madam, please hurry up, I beg. Yes, ma. Toby. Yes, ma. I like what I see. Add a bit more flair. All right. Okay? I will. 
I like and make sure you ha add your signature. All right. Good. Yes. Um, shade here a bit more. Okay, ma'am. Good job, everyone. I need to step out now, but make sure you finish your drawings before you leave, okay? All right, All right ma'am. Late. Yeah, well, it's better late than ever. Wow, you smell good. Oh, thanks. It took Ayo's perfume. <laughs> yeah, um, speaking of Ayo, how are things? Nowhere. He's trying to be honest, but the truth is, I can't get past what he did. Yeah, well, like I told you, if you want to make this work, you have to forgive him. Otherwise, there's no point of you even being there. I'm trying. Well, I hear you. Now you hear me when I say we need to get this end of things popping. So let's warm up here, run the mouth, then we go over to the weights. OK. You are the therapist here. Whatever you say goes. <laughs> <laughs> We have ten more. <sighs> ten more. <sighs> shit. Shit, 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 shit. What's wrong? Shit, shit. It's him. And the ball now. <laughs> Baji, good afternoon. Uh, Dave. What's up? Don't start. Chop no cool. Good evening. What's up? I'm fine. Hello. Hello. Hey, good evening. I was uh, checking the weights. Yeah, I haven't seen you around here before. Yeah, it's, it's my first time. You? Um, like a thousand times, you know. This is where I, I train my clients. You're a trainer? Yeah. I, I think I mentioned that to you before. So anytime you need my help for your workouts, you know, just call on me. I got you. Um, that won't be necessary. You see, Anna here has our full workout plan with her. I do? Yes, you do. Um, I do. <laughs> sure. Cool. I'll be heading back to my clients, OK? The bowler <laughs> with the jam now. Uh, we'll see you now. Take care. Take care. All right, bye, Dave. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Let's go. Aya, what's this? I'm not... All of this is for my wife. Let me bathe you. Babe, come on. You know what? Shh, don't say anything, OK? I've run your water. Mm -hmm. Let me bathe you, please. Stop. Get off me. What am I going to do with this now? But, babe, we miss you. the light on your way out.
You know, I didn't think you were going to come today. And why not? Because of him. I've moved past him. I'm sure he has to. Yeah, but I still kind of feel responsible for everything that went down. Come on, Ine. He didn't do anything. I, I felt bad that night and I, I slept with him, but it wasn't your fault. All you did was make sure he was available. Okay, so wait, you're indirectly calling me a drug dealer. What? I didn't make you take the drug, but I made sure you had direct access. Fantastic. No, darling. Whether or not you went to that table, I would have found someone else. You only made sure I had someone that you could trust. I didn't think you were going to go through with it. That night, I called him at the hotel. So why did you? Because I thought you were joking. I wanted to call your bluff. I didn't realize how serious you were until you fought the shit. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. I, I don't think you were thinking. I put you both in this situation with what he did. Don't get me wrong. I'm not excusing or judging you for what you did. But I'll say your own cheating is more of a temporary insanity. So wait, do you think I should tell him? What? Hell no. Look, girl, with the way things are between you guys right now, how do you think he's going to react knowing that you slept with another man. That's true. He's always said he's gonna kill him. Great. Don't send him to jail for murder. Just act like it never happened. I think you're right. Of course. Look, just forget about Dave. Forget about that night. Just focus on working out marriage. That's the most important thing right now. Absolutely. Don't worry. You'll be fine. You have to stop following me, Mrs. Susan. Uh, I could say the same for you. Say so when I came to work at my gym, yeah? <laughs> uh, well, that was Annie's idea. I'm sorry. She don't just get out. <laughs> anyway, how have you been? Well, I'm good. Whoa. I can see you've got quite a sweet tooth. Oh, they're for my daughter. Then we should have it. Wait, hold on. This is what I call her. Chocolate and watercolor. Man, your daughter is boiling. Uh, first of all, the watercolor is for me. She won a bet. And the prize is that I've got to paint something that looks like a superhero Wait. for her. You're an author? I uh, know, but I teach art. Whoa. That's some kind of Picasso thingy in a killer body. <laughs> first of all, I am nowhere near Picasso in terms of talent. Secondly, killer body, really? Well, that means with a wicked trainer like me and with the right diet, you will have it. God already gave you this goods. <laughs> Lagos men can't lie. Come on, I'm not lying. You know what? You just let me, OK? I will train you for free. Why would you want to do that? Because I want to let you know that with the right diet and the right exercise, I can transform you to whatever you want. I. I don't think it's such a good idea, considering that... Wait, wait, that night was just that night, okay? This is personal training, and we should be able to separate it, too. You're back with your husband, right, and you're working things out? Yeah. So, you see, there's nothing to worry about. So, I know what. Think about my proposal, and you hit me up. Okay, I will. All right. All right. Bye. Bye. I need to finish up. Mm -hmm. And stop following me. Oh, please get out. Just stop. <laughs>
Hello? What did you do that for? Why did you pay for my water cooler and a few items? It was a gift. Just a thank you. Why do you keep wanting to do stuff for me? Because I'm a nice person. And why are you being nice to me? Because you're a good person. Plus, I got a thing for helping good people. Good people don't do what I did that night. I don't judge you from that night. You should. Honestly, I thought you called me to take up on my offer. I'm still thinking about it. And besides, if I take you up on your offer, I will have to pay or there's no deal. I don't want your money. But I could take a painting. You're an artist, right? So rather than pay me, you can pay me something that I can put on my wall at home. That's funny. You've never seen my work and you want me to paint something for you. I trust you. So do we have a deal? I don't know. Well, think about it and let me know. I've got to go because I'm driving. Okay. Thanks, anyway. You're welcome. So how was your day today? Great. I had the students um, create superheroes around who they are. Oh, that sounds interesting. Did you see any of them that you liked? Mm -hmm. I think I liked all of them. But there was one in particular, and I really hope he continues with what he created. Mom, you said you draw Wonder Woman for me. Of course. Don't worry. When mom is done, she'll let you know. Okay? Can we post it on the wall with the rest of the superheroes? Of course we can. But only, only if you paint with me. Daddy and I will. Um, continue with your food, okay? <clears throat> this. You can go talk her in. Okay. Thank you. You can sleep here. That's it. Sure. I don't know how to say I'm sorry. I messed up. I regret it. We were going through a very, a very rough patch. And you were busy with work. I guess I was busy with work too. And, and, and we, we had a disconnection. I tried. 
it wasn't working. And it's, it's not an excuse for what I did. It's not. But even on rare occasions when you made love to me, it was as though you, you weren't there. As if you, you didn't want to be there. Like once again, it's not an excuse, right? I'm sorry. So what is it? Am I too old for you now that you couldn't just sit me down to tell me that I wasn't pleasing you anymore? Too old. No, oh, babe, no. I didn't want to hurt you. You think me finding out that you were cheating was a better way for me to know that I wasn't pleasing you? You weren't supposed to find out. Is this your first time of cheating on your wife? Yes, it is. And it is an action that I regret. Right now, I... I want to make it up to my wife and do everything possible to fix our marriage. That's why I'm here. Susan? Do you want to fix your marriage? That's why I'm here. I'm tired of having nightmares about the feature that I saw on his phone and flashing images of my husband sleeping with another woman. Mm. You know, um, have you had any moments of uh, thinking of uh, revenge or getting back at him or cheating on your no. husband? Oh, well, fine. Uh, we're dealing with uh, one-time infidelity, right? It just happened on one side. I hope we're not keeping any secrets behind, so we lay all cards on the table. And then since you both are telling the truth, all right, and nobody is hiding anything, so it becomes very easy to repair this marriage. I'm willing to do anything. That's the spirit. That's the spirit, okay? And everybody should be ready to do anything to get it working. Let me be honest with you, Susan. This is the first time a woman has walked into my office to accuse the husband of cheating, and she's cool and calm about it. Have you had time to vent your anger to allow it to come out of you? Have you ever had that kind of time? I've had my moments. My wife has, for as long as I've known her, she has never really been one to be on the extreme of things or be too emotional about anything. It's okay, so let's be honest with each other. So long as you don't keep back anything, you don't bottle your emotions, it will be easier for you to heal than when you bottle your emotions, it gets a bit harder. Okay. Um, well, for our next session, I'm going to give you an assignment. Um, you both will write a letter to each other. And in this letter, you express every single emotion, every single feeling you've not been able to tell each other. When you now come for the next session, 
will read these letters out and we will discuss them. And we uh, we can't share the context of this letter beforehand? That would defeat the essence of writing the letter individually. I probably would have told you to write it together. But it's not a problem. Write it individually, and when you come, we'll look at these letters, then we can discuss them, OK? OK. That'll be all today. All right. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. You. What's up, man? I'm good. So tell me, how's the family? Everything is good. Let's watch the game, please. So the counseling isn't working? Do you want to know the truth, please? We've only had one session, one. The first thing she brought up was the video. Can you imagine? What did you expect? I'm going to tell you this for free. Your wife is handling this a whole lot better than my Tonya would. If you turn this table around, by now I should either be dead, homeless, or even both. What happens to not kicking a man when he's down? The Susan I married, but a woman. I fell in love with, does not have a single malicious bone in her body. So I don't know where this is coming from. I hear you. But Sharp, thank God that <laughs> that woman does not live anywhere close here. And it's just a one night thing. Because I guarantee you, you'd probably have a whole lot bigger problems in your hand right now. Well, my problems are already big. It's like a swarm of bees. Um, Oh. How come? What is this? What's what? It's a text message from you know who. Don't tell me you have plans to respond to that. No, I deleted it. I'll just ignore her. She'll eventually get the message and she'll move on. If really you want her to move on, I reckon you just block her and... I mean, she'll get a hint. But hey, it's your call. <sighs> She'll move on. Trust me. Like I keep telling you, this isn't nothing for you guys. This guy is the wrong guest of all That's bikes. a lie. That's a lie. We're just having a bad day. Right, bad calm day. down. You want nothing. One go. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> you want to bet? <laughs> <laughs> oh, not you. <laughs> Hi, guys. So, Tonya said dinner will be ready in 10 minutes. All right, fine. We'll be there. OK. Guy, 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 hey. guy, guy, guy. Yes. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. We'll be fine. <laughs> Let's enjoy this game. <laughs> I am enjoying the game. <laughs> hey. Hi, girl. Dinner is almost ready. Mm -hmm. Do you want some more wine? No, I'm good. OK. Uh... Mofi cheated on me once. What? When was this? While we were engaged, he cheated with some woman he helped in an emergency. And that bitch made him cupcakes, especially to thank him. Wait, how did he go from desserts to sex? Well, that's the exact question I asked as well. Anyways, I called off the wedding, and it took him three months to beg for me to forgive him. So when did you finally forgive him? On the day that we were supposed to get married, he came to my apartment and picked me up. He took me to the Japanese garden in Ikoi. For some reason, he was able to convince his parents and my parents as well to come. 
And at that time, my father hated him. He hated Morphe so much. While we were there, he went on his knees right in front of my family. And at this point, there was this thing I saw in his eyes that made me change my mind. He didn't care about his pride. He didn't care about how people looked at him. And at that point, I knew he had learned his lesson. Wow. He went all out. Yes, all out. And of course, he knows better not to cheat next time because we're done forever. So how did you move past it? Because honestly, I can't seem to get over the fact that I saw what I saw on his phone. Babe, I can't imagine watching a video of Muffy having sex with another woman. I'll probably kill him if he does that to me. Fam. I killed him like a hundred times in my head already. Of course, as it should be. I had to even tell my friends and family that the wedding had been called off. It was... Oh, babe, I know it's hard, but you'll be fine. You'll definitely be fine, OK? Hello, mommy. Hello? I've been trying to dial your number. What is it? Well, mommy, I just want to ask. No, I, I want to plead for you not to give Sarah too much sweets. I raised you and your brother alone. I think I know what I'm doing. I know. I'm just pleading. Mom, please. No sugar, OK? I'm asking you to leave me and my grandchildren alone, Susan. Good night, too. Good night, Mom. Love you. Guys, 
Afternoon. My baby school closes in like ten minutes. Okay, bon. See you later. I'll see you guys later. All right. All right. Bye. Bye. Bye, Bye, baby. Take care of yourself. All right. Bye. Let's go. Bye. I know. I have to go now. Sorry, sorry. Hold on. I need to let you know something. Okay. So. The initial agreement was for me to train you alone. And then you switch things all by bringing in there. So this man right here is insistent on a trade painting for my payment. But you really haven't seen any of my work. Why are you so confident? But there's no way you're able to win the Brick Pain Award if your talent isn't top notch. Wait, you've been talking to people about me? No, just Google. I, I saw it and I liked it. So, is this a deal? First, you have to help me lose 10 pounds. Come on, no biggie. I would like to see you here tomorrow by 1 p.m. Of course, I'll be here. 30 sets, so 15 reps. No set. problem. <laughs> She isn't. I just checked. Oh, okay. Mm. Mm. I had a dream. I was made the Super Eagles coach. <laughs> you don't even watch football. I know. Exactly. What are you writing? Well, um, I'm just trying to finish my letter, basically. Lazy man. I agree. <laughs> so tell me, um, What's your day looking like today? <sighs> Nothing much. I have two adult classes and our session. That's it. Okay. Can I borrow your car after our session? Hello. Well, unless you give it back to me with a full time. Sue, come on. Deal or no deal? Okay, half tank. No, full tank. Um, okay, all right. But I don't blame you. But tomorrow I'm getting my car back. Whatever. Uh -huh. Right now you're a beggar. I agree. <laughs> okay. Lazy bird. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, you're forgetting something. Buster. <laughs> <laughs> Contents indicate that you're interested in healing this marriage. But Susan still harbors a little heart in her. I'm trying to get over it. Yes, we can see that you're trying. But sometimes there are things we can't force ourselves to get to grips with. What do you mean, sir? You, you told me that it took you one week and a half to take your husband back. Well, that's because I didn't want it to affect our daughter. But what affects you will affect your daughter. I, um, I just, I just feel like if she, if she has both parents, it won't affect her as much. Hmm. Are your parents together? No. My mom, um, she raised my brother and I, but... 
That's not a life that I want for my daughter. So you're afraid that if this marriage were to split, he won't care for his daughter? No, no, no. He loves Nera. He, he would always care for her. Mm. But that's not good enough for you. Okay, Susan. Um, I want you to answer this for me. Are you interested in healing this marriage because of your daughter or because you love your husband and you want your marriage to work? Um. No, I want you to think. Just think. Don't worry. You'll, um, you'll um, answer that in the next session. Oh, I can see that um, you're, you're confused. I can see that on your face. You know, there are certain mistakes we make that um, we're not able to have a second chance. I know, I... I messed up. And I, I take full accountability for my actions. That's why I'm here, because I want, I want this marriage to work. Yeah, but you can't save your marriage unless Susan comes to terms with it. You know that? Yes, sir. Good. Please help me. I, I'm a bit confused. In the meantime, what do I do? Keep being supportive. Keep reassuring her that there's no other woman except her. Um, you know you turn her world upside down. So you still have to allow her that time to heal, right? Okay? Yes, sir. And that'll be all for this session. Yeah. I want to drop. No, he can drop. You can do it. Let's go. You're, strong. ah. You're stronger than no. you think. Just imagine you got to watch here because she wants to see you win. Ah. All right, let's go. Oh, one down, more to go. That's Five, it. Five, Six. four, hold it, hold it. Three, ah. two, oh. one. Oh. Oh. That is what I am talking about. Oh. It's an amazing session, yeah? An amazing session? For who? See, you're going to thank me later. Right. Three, uh, after all, I have a meeting with Faith. With Faith? Yeah, you just have to pray for me. All right. All right, guys. Yeah. I'm done. I'm tired. I can't do this. I can't move. It's her. Really? Yeah. Yes. All right. Really? He was that good? What? I don't know what you're talking about. Right. For your sake, I'm going to pretend I don't. Just so you know, that is not the kind of distraction you should be paying attention to. Not now that you're trying to fix your marriage. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> We still have a few more rest to go. Go away. <laughs> we, still have, we still have one more session. No, I'm not. I'm not doing that with you. Please, no one is horny. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Yes. So did you miss me? Someone. Oh, mm. oh I miss the smell. Mm. You know what? What? So give me five minutes and I'll be out of the shower. Okay. 
Is she not gonna tell Louis that you've been very, very abused? You don't want to tell my mom. <laughs> Hurry. All right. Hey, is that my phone? Yeah. Please help me check who it is. Okay. I hope it's Oscar. That's what? Babe, it's your birthday. Why are you looking at me like this? What's the problem? You cheat. Check your phone. Hey, babe, calm down. What's wrong? You lying bastard. What's the point of going to counseling if you're going to continue fucking around? Okay, babe. Look, I blocked her. I blocked all her numbers. That's why she's reaching out to me with a new number. I swear. Then how I wasn't... the hell did she know you're going to wear it tomorrow? Exactly. Babe, hold on. Please, I... Look, babe, okay, just let me explain, please. Please. You don't need any explanation. You have all the time to explain to Pastor Lewis when he asked you if there was any other thing, but instead you lied to my face. <laughs> Babe, wait. Get out of my way! Babe, she's actually been the one trying to actually reach out to me and I'm not responding. And yes, I, I wanted to talk about it, but at the time, we were barely talking. And I felt like telling you more was going to be us apart. And. Could they, could Don't just touch me! Out? Get away! You cheating bastard! I'm going to stay with Eni till I figure out what to do. Hey, babe. Penny, I beg, call me when you see this, okay? This man has finished me. Hello? Come on, you know I charge for train decision at night. So what's up with you? Um... Where are you? Well, I'm at home watching football, but I can be anywhere else if you need me to be. Um, wh where do you live? Come on, I don't really give out my address. I can meet you anywhere. Is there any bar or a tree close to you? Yeah, there's a place not too far from here, so I'll just send you the address. Please do that. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'll see you soon. Hey. Hey. Shall we go? Thank you. You're welcome. So are you going to tell me why we are here? I think I'm getting a divorce. What? I thought you were working out things with your husband. I thought I was. But he's going to see the same girl he cheated on me with. But I've been so stupid. No, you shouldn't, OK? I mean, what's the point of going to a marriage counselor? Why, if you are going to go back to the same thing you have been doing? Dave, I, I want to cry. I, I really want to cry, but I, I am tired. I'm tired of crying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I dragged you out. I, 
Well, I I'm glad you did, okay? I was having one of the worst days of my life. Why? You know, the faith meeting I told you about. Yeah, I'm so sorry. I didn't ask. What's up with that? My partner pulled out at the last minute. Just after the last slice, tumbled. The whole domain is full of. Sorry. English. Okay. I am trying to set up a new gym franchise. So my friend that was supposed to be my partner backed out and all the investors followed it. And here I am with a 25 million dent in my plans. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. It's, it's fine. You know what I do on days like this? I drive around the town, up, down, non-stop for hours. I eat up all the junks in the world, and then I get back to the gym the next day and walk myself out. But I can't do that anymore because I'll say shout out to this economy, you know? You'll be fine, okay? I... So you, what do you do to distress? Is that even a word? It is the word. I am, um, honestly, I just go to sleep and pray that I wake up in the morning happier and I feel better. Before I got married, I would, I would paint. Really? But I can't do that anymore. Oh, no, you, you can't still do that. You know, I have my painting hanging at the temple in France, and that painting was born on a night like this, but. Now, with my kids, my marriage, my husband, I can't do it anymore. Just... No, you can still do that, okay? So your kid, your daughter is sleeping. And your husband is running mad. So this is the best time of your life to recreate another masterpiece, mm -hmm. you know? I see the vision. <laughs> hey, but what's in this drink? It's, it's kind of kicking my ass. I don't think so. Nothing else. Except you have light brain for a call. Um, no, I don't. <clears throat> um, just can you pay so we can go? What? What? Hold on. I think I left my wallet. Okay. No, it's okay. I invited you out, so it's only natural that I pay. Here. Yeah. The pin is 2024. <clears throat> Okay. No, no, I, I can try. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. Okay. I can try. No, you can't. I will have to drive you home, but first before you pay me. Oh, you want another pain No, I want a kiss. I love you, baby. Why would you treat me like that, Ayo? This is not Ayo, this is Dave. Dave, no, no, no. No, no Dave, I don't want to. No, Dave. I'll, 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 I'll take it easy. No, Dave, stop. No, Dave, I don't want to. No, Dave, I'll take it easy. No, Dave, stop. Stop, Dave. Hey, hey, what do you think you're doing? Come on.
Okay. Oh my God. You're finally awake, thank God. How did I get here? Um, I you brought you? How do you feel? Uh. You know what, I'll, I'll go get the nurses, okay? You feel better now. I feel better. That's good. Hey. Hey. Ah, uh, hi. Hi. Anna. Yeah. Please, can you excuse us? Uh, okay. Sure. How are you feeling? I feel okay. Who was that guy? His name is Dave. He's Anna's friend. I, I met him that night. I saw that video of Viano Loma on your phone. We went out and had some drink. Don't tell me you slept with him. It, 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 it was just the one time. Talk as much. I hope you just come. I hope you just speak. I hope. to continue to ignore me like this all day. I have nothing to say to you. I'm sorry. It's another time I felt hurt and betrayed. I didn't know what else to do. I just wanted to to get even. I wanted you to feel hurt. I, I wanted you to feel the way I felt. I... Congratulations, Sue. I feel more than terrible. I'm sorry. I, I swear. I... I have one question to ask you. If it was a one-time thing, why was it the first person you called? The moment we had an issue, why? No, no, he, he wasn't the first person I called. The, the thing is, um, I, I, I wasn't communicating at all with him, but I started going to that gym and I saw Dave Don't there. Don't mention that name in this house. So I, 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 I saw him there and um, he promised to, to help out with our gym sessions. And the truth is I've only had four sessions and he, he promised to help with my gym in session. And like I said, we've only had four sessions. And Enne has been there the whole time. I, I promise you. You can ask Enne, she, she will repeat the same thing that I've just said. Do you think I'm stupid? No. No. Enne is your friend. What are you expecting her to say? Except back up your cock and bull story. This is the truth, I swear. 
I'm late for my flight. And I have to go. When are you going to be back? I have no idea. It's taking too long. That should be here, so it must have been traffic. Oh, there she is. Hi. Hi. Hi, Hi, Hi. 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 How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Good. So, how are you? He's going to worry tomorrow. I'm sure he's definitely going to see that Uloma girl. Um, how do you know that? Anyway, um, here's your card. I got it back from Dave. He's going to be transferring one million naira to you within the hour, or we're hitting him up with rape charges. <laughs> Annabella, baby, I love you. I too love. You. I love you. Thank you. Thank you. That's it. My life is literally falling apart. I need right now is some sick cycle and and his one million naira. My marriage is over. He said that. Didn't need to say it. You need to you'd have seen the way he looked at me. Look, um, I think he's just angry. Okay, you need to give him time. He'll come around, okay? And Pastor Lewis will help him see the light. And he cheated first. Okay, just give it time. And I'm going to be taking Sarah with me. Okay, I don't want her to see on this light. You don't have to. I know, but I want to. Look, I'm rooting for both of you, okay? And I want you guys to sort this out. I don't know what to say. Don't have to say anything. Look, everything will be fine. He'll come around. Look, you don't have to do that. Just give him time. He'll come around. Just trust him. So, madam, let's just wait a little bit for him, okay? Okay. Sorry I kept you waiting. Good morning. Good morning, brother Ayo. If you don't mind, I'd like to hit the nail at the head and go straight to the point. Go on. I'm sorry I wasted your time. I think this whole counseling thing has been a waste of time. Because, because this is not going to work and we are never going to get back from this. Why do you say that, Brother Aya? How will I continue to live in the same house with a woman? and call her my wife, knowing fully well that she is sleeping with another man. From what I hear about your boyfriend, I think you need to get tested. Calm down, brother. You calm down. Uh -huh. Calm down, you know. There's no need to cast us passions here. You have to need to the first toe. You cheated first. Don't forget. So calm down. Hmm? OK? I cheated first, but I was also trying to fix it. Right now, my heart is broken into too many pieces, and it is shattered. I want no parts in this marriage. I, 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 not so fast, Brother Ayo. Don't take it out this fast. Think about it first. Hmm? Huh? I will see myself out. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hmm. 
I knew he was going to be like this. Oh, so did I. You know, women are like that. When we find out that our women have cheated on us, we get very angry, you know, because we think we've lost. I've never seen him like that. He would never have tried to take off his ring before. Mm. You know, Susan, I've been in this for more than eight years now. And I've seen so many men coming with the same complaints, but they react in different forms. But there's something I'll tell you. He will be back. I know, Ayo. When he says he's done, he's done. Yeah, but I am a man. I'm also the one telling you. You know, Susan, I, I think uh, I could carry on this session with you alone. Why? Because of Dave? Oh, no, no, no. We've discovered quite a lot of other things we need to settle. I, I would like you to think about it. OK. I'll think about it. OK. Thank you. All right. I, I want to talk to you. It's okay. Say what you want to say. I spoke to Murphy. He's out of town. But he'll definitely be back by the weekend. Without divorce papers. What? Don't panic yet. I'm not kicking you out. I've got my eyes on some properties. A particular property on the island. And I will have to stay for a while before I move out. When the papers are finalized, we will work out the finer details. Wow. Yeah. So what was it you wanted to say? Nothing. OK. All right, then. Excuse me. Mr. Lewis, mm. your visit here is quite uh, unusual. Oh, yes, brother Ayo. Well, I actually woke up this morning and decided to see you. Well, I hope there's no problem. Well, there are problems. Uh, but the most pressing now is that you've not attended the sessions twice. I already told you I'm done with that marriage. Hmm. Mm. Yes, yes. So, um, how was life treating you as a 38-year-old single man? I know the grass is green on the other side. Of course. At least no one is lying to me mm. or cheating on me, you know. It's good. Mm. You know, I've been praying for you to find someone. You know, and you start learning, you know, the process of... Uh, Knowing the person, the do's, the don'ts, the likes, the dislikes, the phobias. And then you date her for two years. After that, you take her down the aisle and marry her. And then you begin life at 38. Oh, by the way, by now you would have been 41. Oh, yes, but you opened the door first to the cheating. 
But I understand. It, it's better to have everything burnt to the ground than to seek forgiveness, isn't it? I was seeking forgiveness. But she... She, she, she cheated on me out, out of revenge. Oh. And how, how do you think that's supposed to make me feel good? Brother Ayo, would you rather have her fall in love with a young man before cheating on you? You know, she wanted to hurt you like you hurt her. Of course, that was wrong. I am not supporting what she did. But, Brother Ayo, I have some questions for you. For the seven years you were married to Susan, was she a good mother to your daughter? Mr. Lewis, she was a good wife, but that is not uh, the point uh, here. Uh, 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 uh. Yes or no would suffice? Yes. Great. And you want to throw all these away and start afresh at 38? Brother Ayo, you know, I've had sessions with Susan. She's really sorry for what happened. And she truly, truly misses you. And from the look of things, you miss her too. The look of things, what, what things? Oh, Brother Ayo, I have never seen you wear a rumpled shirt before. Oh, yeah, this, uh, this actually a wardrobe. Oh, absolutely. A wardrobe malfunction, my cleaner. Uh, absolutely. Um, Brother Ayo, I'd like you to do me a list. A list of the pros and cons of your life with Susan. And now, if the cons are greater than the pros, divorce her. But if the pros are greater than the cons, attend the session on Thursday. I'm leaving for my office. It's a pleasure. Don't forget, Brother Ayo, attend the session on Thursday. He's still coming. Let's just start. Oh, he will come. Unless he didn't do the list. What list? Don't worry. Good hmm. morning, Ayo. Good morning. Good morning, Brother Ayo. I'm sorry I'm late. I had a faulty car. Well, before we start, let the person that left my door open go and close it. Good, Brother Ayo. You're welcome. Beautiful petals, the candles, 
And yet, here stands the most beautiful piece of art in the room, my wife. <laughs> Mm. Where's her? I sent her to my mom. Oh. <laughs> You're being a naughty girl. And I like it. The phone's ringing. I wonder who that is. It's okay. All right. I'll take it. And then I'll come take you. Who is it? Sir. Fuloma. What? Yes, hello. My name is Susan Aya's wife. Whatever it is you think you had with my husband is done and over. If you as much as text this number again or call this number, I will not be responsible for whatever it is that happens to you. Are we clear? Good. Feisty. I like feisty. Come here. Come here. You know, I could watch you sleep all day. Last night was explosive. Mm -hmm. So do you want to top up? What plans do you have for me? This is all your plan. I'm not the one who sent our kid on the weekend. And I'm not complaining. Neither am I. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Love is patience. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. It does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered and it keeps no record of wrongs. Love is forgiving. This is love. I love you. I love you more. <laughs>